Welcome back to the Lead Quizzes 3 Academy. In this video, we're going to show you how to create custom results that your quiz takers will see at the end of the quiz. Now there's two different types of results that you can create. The first is the URL redirect. The URL redirect will send people to the URL of your choice at the end of the quiz if that is the result that they get. To use the URL redirect, just click on URL redirect under the results tab and drag it over to the results box on the right. Once you do that, you're going to see a little pop-up. And that pop-up is going to ask you for a title. Now this title is just going to be internally, so you know what result this is. So this could be style result one. And then it's going to ask for your website URL. Now if somebody gets this result, at the end of the quiz, they're going to be taken to that URL. So I typed in leadquizzes.com, which is where they'd be taken to. Now the second type of result that you can create is using the results builder. To click on the results builder, just click on the results builder on the left, drag it to the results box on the right. Here you're going to be building the result in the software, and there's a couple of different features that you have here that you can do. So the result title, now that is something that your quiz takers are going to actually see. So you might want to say something like, your style is classic. Then you can add in text here. You can also add in images or videos. You can do bulleted lists, numbered lists. You can change the font size, the font color. And to see a live preview, just click on the preview tab right here at the top and you're going to see what that looks like. Another option you can do with the results builder is turn on social sharing. When you turn on social sharing, it will allow your quiz takers to share the quiz directly onto their Facebook, Twitter, LinkedIn, or via email with just the click of a button. Once you have your results set, just go ahead and click save. Now you can create as many results as you would like, but in order to ensure that your quiz takers actually see a result, you need to match your results up with your quiz questions and their answers. You're essentially going to tell the software, if somebody answers questions this particular way, this is the result that they should see at the end. In the next video, I'm going to cover how you can match up your results with the correct answers and how that result is determined at the end. So the way that the software determines what result to show somebody. I'll see you guys in the next video.